Hi, and welcome back. Today we're going to talk about some um, the ball python. She is a beautiful snake. This is Miss Love Bubbles right here. She's actually still going through a shed a little bit, so she has some um, scales that she's still losing. Um, she is just, she's wonderful. I love this girl. She's um, just super sweet. She's definitely our little cuddle love bug. Um, so Alex is going to talk to you about her, and you'll learn some more stuff about her. Hello, today we're talking about the ball python. Um, the ball pythons, they grow pretty big. Um, right now she's about three feet. They will go up to six and five feet. So another two or three more feet to go and she'll be her full length. Nonetheless though, um, they will grow for the rest of their lives. So until she is dead, she will keep growing and growing and growing. There's nonstop growing with ball pythons. You can see she's shedding right there still. Some shed got into my hand. Yes, it did. Um, right here, the shed, I'm still researching if we could take or help take off this shed. Uh, what you could do though, um, if you don't want to peel it off, you could go and stick her inside of a warm bath, really warm temperature bath, and you could place her inside, and it'll help her get all her skin that she's about to lose off. As you can see, overnight, she has put tons and tons of skin right there. Right there, you can, if you could see it, it's right Go ahead and grab it. here and there where I just it dropped it. Yeah, sure, I'll take it out. Right here, this is snake skin. You could see right here that this is part of the belly. This is part of where she lost right here. This is the belly part, because if you see, if I were to flip her over right here on her belly, it looks exactly the same. So, once snakes shed, they will feel like a baby. Like, they will turn so soft. So, my desk. Um, what else do you need to know about snakes? Where's she from? Where's she from? Um, I gotta think. I really don't know. You forgot that one already? <laughs> yeah, I forgot this one. There's so many different okay, animals so, I totally forgot. So how warm do you have to keep her tent? Um, the cool side would normally be 80 to 85. The warm side would be 90, 95, even 100. So those are the warm sides, hot sides. The cool side would be 70 and 80. Okay. Most of the time. And what does she eat? She hasn't eaten yet, but she what is... She hasn't eaten. We've got her about maybe one or two months ago um, from the Cow Palace at an expo, Reptile Expo. Norm normally, she would eat a medium size or small rat, but she hasn't been willing to eat at all lately so and ball pythons are pretty picky <laughs> and sometimes they can go six months without eating so we're not too concerned yet but another <coughs> month or two and we're gonna have to find a um a vet for her just to kind of rule some things out but she is an amazing girl um and again there's her there's her um terrarium where she lives Alex keeps the heat lamp on her all the time, so nice and warm. She does not need UV. Okay. Thank you. Bye, Ms. Love Bubbles. We'll see you later. Grandma loves you. Bye-bye. Where does Miss Love Bubbles think she's going? Oh. No, and down I go. Trying to get up the 
Mom, I'm gonna move to the other side and to the other side, then I'm down.